most young musicians, but 20 years ago it became a nightmare for a couple of San Diegans. They were with a psychedelic rock group called Iron Butterfly. And tonight in the first part of his special series, Whitney Southwick introduces us to bass player Jerry Penrod. You know, Paul, when Jerry Penrod graduated from Claremont High, his ambition was to play football, not rock music. San Francisco was where it was happening in the 60s. Mecca, if you were a rock musician. The lyrics told of free love and drugs. And more often than not, those singing the songs practiced what they preached. They had all the money, the women, the booze, the drugs. I mean, you wanted it. I mean, it was just all there. You know, everybody wanted this. 20 years ago, yeah, it was living. That was life. And that was a good life. For Jerry, the good life lasted only a short time. He quit Iron Butterfly before Ingata De Vita brought it national attention. He kicked around with a couple of other groups, then finally burned out and addicted to drugs. He called it quits and returned home to San Diego. Two bad marriages and a drug rehab program later, Jerry today is back on his feet and for the past 10 years has driven a bus for the city of San Diego. Love it. Love it. It's really a good job. A lot of people, you know, you have a lot of interaction with a lot of different people, and you can make people smile. You probably know people who take to work home with them at night. Well, Jerry does too, but in a very special way. He goes from driving a bus to living in one. It's nice. It's fun, you know. I bought it a couple years ago, and just, you know, it's like, it's my big boat. And uh, I can go where I want, I can move when I want, you know. And today, Jerry moves in a much different direction than 20 years ago. His nickname, The Bear, more for appearance than personality. As for music, well, he still picks up his guitar now and then, but says he'll never return to the stage. The life's just frantic, too fast. You just about got to do drugs. Uh, it's always there. And it's just, it's fast. And it's hard, hard life. What's important to Jerry Penrod today? Be the best I can be. Being happy. That's important to me now. 